little remodeling going on in California. Perhaps you've heard about it. The goal is by 2025 to have 1.5 million zero emission vehicles in California. And then there are all kinds of stepping stones to their goals. By 2045, they want to have complete carbon neutrality. By 2035, sales of all but electric and fuel cell cars will be banned in the state of California. All right. So on the surface, I, and I know for a lot of people, that sounds like, yes, that's exactly what we need to do. And in some ways, limited supply of oil. I mean, it it makes we make new oil. It just takes about a million years. But, <laughs> okay, it's a limited resource. But... Is this the right avenue? I mean, not, to me, the jury's still kind of out on it. Well, we've been we've been kind of studying. Okay, first of all, there are issues right now making any kind of cars. All right, so they're trying to get stuff. And... You're going to end up with a big wheel and be happy. Yeah, so. yeah exactly. <laughs> but, no, to have all of these mandates, right. you got to wonder how much of it is real, how much of it is, it is optics. I mean, California is very much about what you look like. Is of it course. optics? And what is the downside of what's happening by making these alternative fuel vehicles? Been doing a little research, and it's not—it's not all sunshine and lollipops. So if your car's electric, thank the lithium mines that tear up the landscape. Damage lasts a long time for electric. They're now dredging up the ocean for the cobalt and nickel that keeps your EV in motion. So keep on eating plant-based burgers and wearing hemp clothes. But your car's an earth killer, pal, just so you know. You had to buy electric. Did he say keep wearing hemp clothes?